The G profile PDP755 or PDT755 is brand new this year. It has all new features, but at $1199, does it compete against Bosch, KitchenAid, and Miele? In this video, we'll learn about all of the profile's best features and a few problems. Then you'll see a comparison between the profile and, and the other premium brands. At the end of the video, you'll know whether this dishwasher or another brand might be right for you. GE redesigned their dishwasher for 2022 after going back to the drawing board. Their successful odor, mold, and moisture prevention in their laundry was added to this new line of dishwashers. They now feature the microban, antimicrobial surfaces, even on the outside handle, as well as a fan to dry residual moisture to eliminate mold and mildew. Their washing system adds special sprays for silverware and bottles. You have the third rack for silverware, but you also have the basket at the bottom with special sprays as well for really caked on utensils. They also improve the drying with a fan to remove excess moisture and speed drying even for plastics. For quietness, which is important if your kitchen is open to your living room, profiles 42 decibels far below the standards for quietness. However, unlike every other dishwasher we're about to compare, G's quiet with a soft food disposer instead of a filter you have to clean. As you would expect, the profile has plenty of cycles, 11 in all. The problem with American dishwashers like Profile is they protrude and look bad with a panel. Otherwise, G covered the basics with this new unit. One small criticism is the top spray is more of a sprinkler like Bosch, and the third rack isn't as flexible as Milo. Now let's compare at how the Profile competes with Bosch, KitchenAid, and Milo. First, the availability is better, at least for now. It has several unique features like the better wash for bottles and silverware. KitchenAid at $12.99 has their larger third rack and four levels of wash action. But one of those is just apertures or smaller holes from that larger rack. G has more cycles, the dedicated bottle and silverware sprays, and a lower decibel rating with a disposer instead of a filter like KitchenAid. It's hard to know with Miele and their many models, but they have the best technical wash system with three full wash arms and decent drying with their clean air dry system of introducing outside air into the dishwasher to turn the steam into water. Their better models pop open at the end of the cycle to release steam starting at $13.99. GE pulls air out, so it's the opposite of the meal system. Once again, GE will have better cycles along with the bottled silverware sprays at a lower decibel rating without a filter. Bosch at $13.99 has their zeolite crystal dry drying employing volcanic crystals to absorb moisture and emit heat. It's the best drying available. Yet, G will have technically better washing, especially with bottles and silverware. Unless you're placing a panel on it, this dishwasher is certainly competitive to the others, over $1,000 in terms of washing, drying, racking, and quietness. What's better, at least for now, the availability is good and G is better service if you're buying from a store without a service department. It's a good dishwasher to consider, even compared against the best brands. Click the link to download our free dishwasher buying guide with the comparisons all the most popular brands, answers to frequently asked questions, and buying strategies to save you money. Almost one million people have found answers in a Yale guide. Thanks for watching.